All right. In February of 2020, my daughter Tabitha and I went to Colorado to visit some friends. And while there, we went through Colorado Springs specifically to visit the Cave of the Winds. And this video will show you what that experience is like. Breathtaking views all the way up to the front door of the Cave of the Winds. And plenty to see and plenty to do. This is an outdoor playland. I think McDonald's playland for adventure seekers. Uh, so children can get out there and adults as well and enjoy some uh, challenging play. Again, just breathtaking views wherever you turn. And uh, it's amazing. Inside, they have a little restaurant and a beautiful dining area with plenty of windows so you can enjoy that outside view. While we were there, it was a blizzard, believe it or not. And so we couldn't go out on the walkway. But... We are able to see the inside, and it's beautifully done. Very, very nice uh, souvenir shop as well. And there's plenty of information inside to set you up for your experience in the cave. Talking about history and prehistory, if you get into that stuff and if you believe some of it. Also, just remember, you're at a high altitude, so you'll probably hear me breathing heavy. Partly because I'm overweight and partly because it is just hard to breathe up there. So be aware of that if you go in. Five minutes just to get here. I need to raise these ceilings, right? The tour guide did a great job, and inside it's just again beautiful scenes after beautiful scenes of many, many years of rock formations. Looking up, looking around, it's just uh, it's really cool. Depends on if the government's in there. didn't feel good at all. Probably should have ducked them now. This is a really cool cave, but kind of tight. Smooth, real smooth. Remember, you're at a high elevation, you're underground, and you will be doing some climbing and ducking, so be prepared. So this light bulb here is a Thomas Edison bulb installed in 1907. They have never had to change the bulb. There you go. Pretty cool. Thomas Edison, Thomas Edison bulb in the cave of the winds. This is one of those cool, unexpected things when you're going through a sightseeing tour and a 1907 Edison bulb filament is still good. Um, who would have expected 100 years plus just a really cool thing, a light bulb in a cave by Thomas Edison.
This is going to be a great yeah. selfie. But I think we need to come back a little more. Okay. Just yeah. a little mountain in there? Yeah. Just right. come on. A little bit more? A little bit more. Yeah. Tabitha! Tabitha! Oh, no! Tabitha! Oh, no! Oh, man. Um, tell you what, this is going to be a pretty good video, though.